I'm a PhD student at the London School of Economics and Political Science, as well as a grad stat fellow of the Royal Statistical Society. I decided to become a statistician because I, I was told that if you're numerate, if you like things that are applied to the real world, you can be an economist or a statistician. If you're an economist, you get more theoretical as you get older. If you're a statistician, you get to do more real things as you get older, and that's what called to me. So I have um, an undergraduate degree in um, maths and French, and I discovered very early on um, throughout that that I really like statistics. So I pretty much specialised throughout my final year um, in, in statistics, and then went on to do a master's degree in, uh, in medical stats, and now I've been working for the last uh, six years at the University of Liverpool in the uh, Department of, of Biostatistics. I started doing mathematics at university and frankly by the second year the pure mathematics although I loved it just got too difficult so I moved into statistics and I found that it precisely fitted my personality an interest in the theory but also the importance of application. I joined the RSS six years ago when I went to conference in Telford. Uh, the Sheffield conference which I think was in 2000 and 13. Donkey's years I, mean, I must be back a little bit of 40 at least 40 years yes. I've been a member for a few years, however, I've been aware of the society for several years. And given that I've spent most of my academic career in statistics, I've always been quite interested in learning what the Royal Society does and how it contributes. Because I wanted to broaden my contacts outside of the industry where I worked. I was in pharma. Uh, and the RSS appeals to so many more people doing so many different things across a wide range of industries and disciplines. I thought that would be a fascinating network to expand into. I realised at the end of my first degree that I actually had grad stat um, affiliation but I didn't apply to it until later because I was learning a lot more about how statistics works. I did quite an applied first degree, I did actuarial science and I wasn't sure if they were necessarily as interlinked as I thought they were. After now doing my PhD I see there's actually quite a lot of scope for the two uh, clubs to join together. However I'm more interested now in learning how to use statistics even further in other fields through my research. Um, so from that first year I, I renewed my membership each year and I ended up joining the conference events committee so I this year in the past couple of years I've been organizing the official statistics stream and also the applications in statistics in particular the sports sections so I think this is I've got one more year left on the uh, panel in that role. Well everyone did and I think quite correctly because you know it, it, it represents our profession it's a pro profession I'm so proud to be part of. Um, so I, I really like events like this, um, I love all the stuff we do in Edinburgh, so we have a lots of local group meetings in Edinburgh which are always well attended. Um, and actually I've made lots of great friends over the years, so coming to events like the RSS conference, um, you see people you haven't seen for a year but you just pick up where you left off and it's, it's really fantastic. Um, and for me it allows you to keep in touch with what's happening in the world of statistics. Um, and learn, so it's great for CPD as well. I like the networking events. They're really good and they give you unique opportunities to meet other statisticians. So there's an opportunity to pool ideas across other fields of interest. I never thought that a biostatistician could teach me something about finance I didn't already know. It's the community. Uh, it's the support you get and the interest you get from talking to people who have the same basic interests but who work in a different area and think about it ultimately the same way as you do. I love being part of the community of statisticians. I've known them all my life. They're a bit nerdy, but extremely trustworthy, and uh, it's a community I want to be part of and support through my membership of the RSS.